Twin Cities woman recently escaped an attack from above. A hawk took aim at her head, and she's not the only raptors, uh, the raptors only victim rather. WCCO's John Lordson shows us how the bird has become a menace in this Maple Grove neighborhood. I didn't even hear them. They're so, so quiet, I mean, which they have to be. Abby Elrod's neighborhood on Polaris Lane has always been peaceful and laid back, but that was before a broad-winged hawk moved in and the dive bombing began. And all it just felt like a huge pressure, boom, right on my head. It kind of felt like a bruise. Like, okay, mom, look, it does look like a bruise. He's like, she's like, no, it's landing tracks. He got you. The attack happened while she was setting up for a garage sale. The hawk left talon marks in Abby's scalp. It also went after her dad and flew off with his hat. Raptor experts say hawks prefer larger, older trees for their nests. And once their young have hatched, all bets are off. Broadwinged hawks are native to South America and call Minnesota home for a few months while they raise their young. Experts say attacks like these are becoming more common as urban sprawl forces the birds to live closer to humans. It's definitely the most excitement we've had in a long time. <laughs> Like Abby and other neighbors, Jade Forrester says she and her son have also been ambushed. Kid you not, you guys, this is like the most powerful gust of wind. It's like a fan on you and you don't know where it's coming from. The hawks will act like that until their young are ready to fly. Then the whole family will leave. In the meantime, owl decoys have proven to be an effective dive bombing deterrent. It's a cheap, very easy solution. Keep moving around, don't keep it in one spot. And they hate it, it's, it's like magic. In Maple Grove, John Lordson, WCCO News. Well, experts at the U of M's Raptor Center say that the bird will eat rodents and small amphibians, but they don't typically kill small pets. But they do say the best thing you can do is to invest in those owl decoys and just wait out the birds.